Okay guys, so we we're gonna do another experiment with these paint pens I was sent um, by the company RDQ, Artico, Artico, ay ay ay. I know probably none of those are the way you're supposed to pronounce that and I apologize in advance. Anyway, oops, sorry. So I have these wood rainbows. I got them actually at Goodwill, but they were originally from Target. And I already primed it with a layer of white gesso, as you can see. I have some gesso I'm trying to use up. And now I want to see how the pens not only work on the wood, but work over the gesso. So we are going to paint a rainbow. So let's get started. <music>
everybody. This is me in all my fabulous morning glory. Anyway, um, this turned out cute. What do you think? I love that. Now the stamp I used is a limited edition Art Foamy stamp. I am a designer for Art Foamies. This stamp is not on their website because you have to be a patron or supporter to get this stamp. So you have to join my Patreon and then I'll send you one. Um, but I do have lots of other designs on their website, so I'll link their website down below. I also used a Faber-Castell Pit Artist Pen. This one is Warm Gray number 274 and Gesso. The Gesso I'm trying to use up. Daler Rowney Acrylic Gesso. So we tried this, by doing this, we tried the pens on a bunch of different things, uh, including cardstock. And then we used the Faber-Castell marker over the top of the, the paint marker. Worked great, by the way. Um, they work well together. Um, we also used it over the gesso. Now I had to do at least two layers. Um, this particular rainbow is like hard to paint like neatly in multiple colors. So that is not the fault of the pens. That's user error user abilities. Anyway, um, so I did choose to distress it with some coffee medium and some other um, finishes, as you saw. And um, I kind of like the fact that it like looks dirty and distressed, because if you're going to like make a mess, like my printing, somebody asked me once not long ago, you know, how did you start writing that way? Because my writing is never like perfectly neat or doesn't satisfy me. So I figured if it was going to be messy, I should just go with that. Um, anyway, the coffee medium is a homemade medium, and the other one was Distressed Collage me Medium, Tim Holtz. Um, all of it worked great with the paint pens, and nice, bright, vibrant colors. You could have done more layers of the paint pens on this than I did two layers. Um, they still seem, I've done two decent-sized product projects with them. They still seem like they have a decent amount of paint in them. So there's that, because I am kind of wondering how long will they last. Um, but so far, so good. So anyway, I will link the pens down below. I'll also link Art Foamies. Again, you can't get this one unless you're a patron or supporter. And um, all of that is down below. Um, but check out some of my other designs. Check out um, the pens. The links for them are down below. I am pretty satisfied with them. And um, see, see what you think. I think they're a pretty affordable option if you want to get into paint pens. All right, that's it for today. Don't forget to go out and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. Shine bright. See you in the next video. Bye, guys.